tennis shoes to look like a kindergartner. Brandon. Did you say you look like a kindergartner? Yeah. Okay. Only kindergartners wear tennis shoes with jeans. Uh, <laughs> but there's gonna be someone watching the video thinking I wear tennis shoes with jeans. And guess what? You should stop. At least with skinny jeans. I think that's what it is. I don't know. It's all in my head. We are headed to Statue of Liberty. Da -da -da -da. Perfect time. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da. Our last full day. What a bummer. We're back at Gregory's Coffee, where I got my coffee last night that you guys didn't get to see. It was amazing. I'll have someone take a picture. Yeah. Okay. Brandon doesn't love his coffee. He got the Apple Jack cold brew with apple, um, apple cider, cider, cold foam. Now we're in line to take a picture with this bowl. So, yeah. And then I have to go get myself. Well, I have my coffee. It's good. It's the same thing I got yesterday, but hot. And then um, I'm going to get a bagel sandwich somewhere. All right, y'all, we are at Glenwich again. Um, we were gonna go to Leo's Bagels, but the line was like out the door. So we might go there for lunch. If this will focus on. Here we go. We might go there for lunch. Possibly? We'll see. I mean, if the line is that long, it must be good. But I liked my scallion cream cheese bagel yesterday, so I'm getting it again. Update on my latte, delicious. I feel bad Brandon doesn't love his coffee, but he's drinking it, kind of. Thank you. Head to the Statue of Liberty. Can you just throw that away from me? It's empty. A little grainy at the bottom, probably. With this from the cinnamon. Okay, we made it through security and we are walking to the bus. Nope, nope, to the ferry. Some rocky waters this morning. Is he a New Yorker or a New Jerseyer? Guess You're not what? called New Jerseyers. We got our selfie. <laughs> So, something I learned today that I never knew is that the Statue of Liberty is in New Jersey, not New York. If you look at the state lines in the water, it's in New Jersey. And the copper sheets are two pennies thick. Yeah. That make up the outer shell. Yeah. Who'd have thought? Back of Lady Liberty. Oh. 
All right, to the gift shop. It's so pretty out here. We're gonna check this out, actually. I don't know if this is the gift shop, but it says Statue of Liberty Museum, and it looks cool. You can walk up those grassy steps. Oh wait, no, the steps aren't grassy. Just kidding. Makes it a little less cool. That's fine. That's fine. What is this? That's the original torch. Oh, moved really? In 1984. Wow. Why was it moved? Uh, I don't know why it was replaced, but they put a new one out there. Wow. All right, folks. That's all for the Statue of Liberty. We are heading home. Just kidding. To New York. And then we're going to go to the 9-11 Museum at 3. Until next time, Lady Liberty. We are here at Joe's Bagels. Hopefully, hopefully it's delicious. We're thinking it will be because there was a line all the way down the sidewalk this morning. Already, already. We have found a place to sit and try our bagel. We got the same thing that I got um, at Lenwich, which is just a plain bagel toasted with cream cheese, with scallion cream cheese, because I feel like that's just how you know. We just want to taste the bagel, right? And uh, the bagels at this place are hand rolled. Ooh, look at that. I gotta take a picture. Bon appetit. Oh wait, Brandon, which building is the New York Stock Exchange? This one? Oh, Brandon's really excited about this. There she is. Oh, it says it up there. Okay. Shabuya, yeah, yeah, shabuya. We're walking. We had our bagel. Thoughts on the bagel? Really good, really good. The bagel from Joe's. You can tell it was Leo's. Oh, Leo's. Joe. <laughs> I don't it's know. Joe. I don't know. Um, that you can tell it's like homemade, fresh, very good bagel. However, I like the cream cheese better at um, Lenwich. But both very, very good. Whatever this is is nice. Nice little sitting area. Very pretty. It's about 1.45 and our museum access begins at 3. Um, so we have a little bit of time to kill, like an hour and 15. So, we're gonna walk down here and probably get something else to like share to eat. We just wanted to try a different bagel from somewhere else and then we'll probably get some food. I'm not that hungry so we might just share something somewhere else. And, yeah. Not Burger King though. Ooh, what about Hank's Pizza? Hank's Pizza looked good but we kind of already had nicer pizza this week. So I'm wanting something that looks a little cheaper, you know, gotta try all different types of pizza. And this looks pretty good, actually. So we're gonna try it. We came upstairs to the VIP lounge. We just gotta 
slice of cheese just to try their classic pizza. See how good it is. Thoughts, Brandon? Decent? Cheesy. Cheesy. <laughs> Ooh la la. Dare I? All right, see you in a minute. He's gotta use the loo. I don't know how much I'm even gonna record inside of the museum. I, honestly, I'm probably not gonna record at all. I'm gonna say, yeah. Yeah. Um. Making a stop before we go into the museum because we have about 30 minutes. And there's this cute street with just like tons and tons of food trucks. Looks like something's calling my name. Really good. Sampling double chocolate chip. Good. Really good? I don't know, but it's good. Okay, we are headed to get in line for the museum, so we'll see y'all later. around 5 it's 5 30 maybe a little after 5 5 15 yeah here 5 22 oh 5 22 okay so we haven't been waiting that long and we're about halfway down the line <laughs> you can see someone in there in the reflection singing his little heart out <laughs> all right party of two we get to sneak past the rest of the line so you're gonna follow me thank you
promise you. Do I do what I want? Guys, that was fun. <laughs>